is doing. This is very important in reverence to the laws and history of America and the fact of the intruders that came into America to slander the American history of people, such as even back in the days of like hundreds of years ago or whatever, that groups of people have came into America to tear down American monuments that were burnt, that were built by people that lived in America, people that was here hundreds of years ago, and people making up lies to tear down monuments is treason. You know, America does not go to other countries to tear down their monuments of people. Of course, they think all their monuments of their country is important people, someone might say. But the claim that the American monuments and the American history they're trying to claim was bad history or something. Now, we need to know where that's coming from. Which people are fabricating their population in America as if they claim they built America. Claim that they constructed the cities, claim that they built the roads, claim they built the farms, claim they built everything. Now, most of the people that only think that are usually Nazis. But I guess there's some other people that are thinking that way or something. It's very serious. This country has been a certain country. Remember, the, of course, the original 13 colonies of Europe, which was the first groups of people in America. You guys know that, right? You can look it up on Encyclopedia Britannica or Encarta or whichever one. But, you know, in reference to the history of things, of people trying to overpower the history of this country, and this, this country has always spoke freedom. But then there are people that came into this country to restrict people's freedom, people's rights before their people had gotten into politics. Now, the activity of this, these organizations or the activity of satellite crimes of these people must get prosecuted. America has history. America has historic societies. The fact of people trying to overbearing those history documents or trying to be overbearing in reference to the history or them trying to overshadow the historic people that helped build this country or the people that was famous in this country for being wealthy or prominent individuals. It's very serious in reference to the lies of government as if they're trying to play their manipulations based on their, their personal gain of what they're trying to do. Like for instance, you know, I'm the owner of my mother and father's estates. U.S. government has to support that. But obviously, some people got into government to try to steal everything from me. They thought they'd make up lies on me. Now, why would they do that? Because they're thieves. And those people need to get prosecuted for their crimes. We need all the evidence of why these people thought that they'd get away with abusing me or stealing from me or holding me hostage or kidnapping me from my mother and father's mansions. We need to know the reason why and what is their leader's name that is blocking me from my mother and father's mansions. Make sure, make sure, government man, make sure you speak very loud in your government position. Because, see, you're even violating laws of impeachment which you should have been impeached from your government position. But obviously you had a bunch of conspirators and they're conspiring against the laws of impeachment. There's always reasons why political people would get impeached. Especially in reference to them and their misconduct of government. There's laws in history in reference to, like, the Census Bureau 
in reverence to abuses and crimes of people in government that they have allowed to go on in this country. And their activity affects a lot of people's lives, what these dirty government people are doing. Like you're violating the American Dentist Association. You're violating my race and religion. You're violating wealth protection laws. You don't own anything that I'm the owner of, and you won't ever. You thought you'd just make up shit, didn't you? Because you thought everybody had to believe you because you were in government? But see, my parents' estate dates back hundreds of years. Before you even got into this country, or before your ancestors even got into this country. Mr. Government Man. So obviously, in reference to board members and executives of any of the companies, there has to be some court cases to see which ones of them are conspiring against me. Your voodoo doll terrorism game is treason in America. The fact that you're hitting me in the face. The fact that you're stealing my money. The fact that you've damaged my teeth. My dentist is an American dentist too, man. You're violating the laws of this country, government man, and you need to get prosecuted for your crimes. You don't have a right violating my life. And you know that satellite man had claimed he was torturing me because he was trying to force me to sell. No. I have seniority. And you're violating seniority. And you're violating the ethnicities of French, English, and Italian, and Asian, and some other races and ethnicities of people. You're trying to mutilate Americans, making up lies on Americans, government man. You don't have a right staying in this country, and you are a terrorist. And you need to get prosecuted for what you've done. Somebody's warning you, you better leave me alone or somebody's going to fuck you up really bad. The way you wanted to get treated, the way you've damaged other people's lives, government man. Like I said before, you're one of those sickos that do these things. The only way to get your fills if it happens to you. Like you're reaping what you sow, huh? You know? You're causing people injuries, you're hurting people. Because you don't feel pain. You don't know what pain is, motherfucker. But once somebody induces some pain on you, you'll fucking realize you didn't think it was such a good idea then, would you? You'd be like, oh, wait a minute, this, that shit kind of hurts, huh? But when it comes back on your way, government man, you're going to regret everything you've done because they have to force the regret onto you. And that's what the laws of America are about. Prosecuting dirty government for treason and dirty activities of satellite controllers and mutilations. There was people in this country before you got into government, government man. And you didn't have a right stealing their lives or money or property or land. And you didn't have a right damaging their faces or their teeth. As you were trying to run them in the ground with your fucking satellites. Or anything else you fucking did in this country. That's why all the politicians have to get DNA tests to see what fucking race they are and what ethnicity and what religion and where they fucking came from.